Okay, so last time on Act Point Five, I showed you how to pipe your independent media into your TV system all around using coax and RF modulator. Well, Darren promised I'll show you how to remote control all of that using a cell phone, and that's what we're doing right now. So, hey, Darren. Hey. Now, you've got this hack worked out for us. Yes. As a uh, turning a uh, internet ready cell phone. Or basically any device. If you've got a PSP or you know pocket PC, laptops, mm -hmm. anything whatever. Anything that can, that can, can connect to your home LAN if or to the web. If you've got a Linux toaster with a web browser on your LAN, that could control your media. Nice. So this is basically a way to control your home theater PC, which we've done now with Fire Ant and Democracy and your mm -hmm. RF modulator hack. And what I want to talk about is ways to customize my favorite uh, media player, VLC. Okay. Of course, I love VLC because it starts with a V and you know VPNs and VPN, v VLC, VLC, VLC and VNC. And VNC and 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 yeah. Okay. Anyway, so uh, what are the requirements for this particular? Well, obviously, we're going to need VLC uh, 0.8x, and we'll also need Apache. You mm -hmm. can either use the 1.3.x build or the uh, 2.x build. Okay. And then we'll also need PHP. Hmm. Okay, it's LAMP. Well, except for the, at the Linux, we're doing it on Windows. P PHP and Apache. Yeah. All right. It works. They work well together. Dude, they're, just, they're great, man. It's, like, a lot. it's the dynamic duo. They get stuff done. It's my favorite hacking tools. Next, same bad station, same bad time, or whatever. Yes, something same like channel. that. So what we need to do is, once we've got all of those installed, we need to mm -hmm. do some customizations. Uh, we need to create a, a HTML file, a PHP file, and then do some customizations okay, to so VLC's we're little, web server. We're going to write a little PHP code, a little HTML code. Yeah. What, what's that going to be? Well, let's head over here. I've got the. Uh, this is our Apache HT Docs folder, and I'm going to go into the index file. All right. And basically, all this is is a starting page, which you know you'll you'll hit the button on your cell phone. It'll take you to this page, and it's got two links. Right. The first link will start VLC on your computer. Okay. And this is this one right here. That's this one right here. So yeah. it's going to open up VLC.php. So let's take a quick look at that. Here's VLC PHP. Really simple. All okay. it is is one command. It's the system command, and it will start VLC. And then give it a directory. That's where our media is being stored from uh, Fire Ant, right. Democracy, iTunes. iTunes. And that's going to act as like a, a playlist, I'm assuming? Uh, exactly. If you hit this, it'll start playing that playlist. Okay. The next one is this command right here, which will start VLC's built in web server. VLC has a web server to allow mm. you to, to, uh, to control VLC, mm. but we're going to have to make some customizations to that. Right. And of course, the next thing being full, full screen. screen. So we set it to full Obvious. screen. So back to our HTML. Mm -hmm. So once we've clicked on the start VLC link, Right. And I'll start playing. Now we need to control it. So that's what this link is here. And the reason for these two links is because it could be done in one link with JavaScript, but I want this to work cross-platform, right. any device. My phone supports JavaScript, but mine does not. Yeah, so this will pretty much run on any cell phone that has an HTML browser. OK. OK, so this will take us to our IP address with the uh, port 8080. That's VLC's web server. So let's head okay. over here. And it looks like you're using the uh, Dyn DNS. I'm using addressing. the Dyn DNS address to, uh, rather than give the IP address out on the show, we're going to do the Dyn DNS. DNS. Yeah, it makes yeah. things easier. Yeah, and plus it, it always redirects your ISP's IP for you. Yeah. To you. So if your IP address changes at home on your cable mode of DSL, yeah, check Dyn out DNS will take DynDNS.com. Sweet. So let's head over to the index.html. This is over in uh, the VLC. So okay, this, this is the VLC, is the v server. VLC side. Right. And the nifty thing about this is here in the head, we've got all of these VLC tags. And these are custom to VLC. And it will interpret these when it, uh, when it runs. OK. So here's the form that this has the, the stop, the pause, previous, next, you know, all the buttons to do your stuff like plus a minute and minus a minute. Mm -hmm. And you've had to actually customize all these to work on yeah. it. Yeah. I've just custom I've trimmed down the, uh, the file so that it will look nice on a phone on a PSP, on an iPad, pocket okay. PC, whatever. Just made it real clean, real simple. Yes. Okay. So, and of course, that code will be in the show notes. So let's, uh, you want to take a look? Yeah, yeah, why don't we get a demo? Obviously, you've got the hack working, or else okay. we wouldn't be doing the segment. So here's the cell phone. I right. got it going, we're on our start page, and I'll just click on VLC, or start VLC. Okay. It takes just a second. Yeah, because we're going out to the internet and coming back. Oh, there it goes. And it's playing our favorite vidcast. So right. now I'll click on the remote button. All right, remote. And here we go. We've got stop, pause, previous, next. Minus a minute, plus a minute. So let's go ahead and just, you know, we'll click next. Some pure ownage. Jeez. Oh, look, there's Ask a Ninja. some Ask a Ninja. That's good stuff. All right. And what else have we got here? Next again. 
Oh, there's oh, some Command, Command N. N. Some Geek Entertainment Television. Mm -hmm. So basically, the idea is you walk in your house, you, uh, you know, after a long a day long at work. Day, yeah, like, you know, like for me, I have a long day at work, and so if I want to sit down and veg out. Definitely. On, on, you know. To some good content rather than the uh, spoon fed crap we find on cable television. Yeah, really. Yeah, if I just want to veg out to the boob tube with some quality entertainment, I can fire it up on my cell phone when I hit, you know, hit the driveway. And by the time I walk in and turn on your TV on to channel TV. two, channel two is now the coolest or four, channel. Or, or three, four, whatever. three. Oh yeah, I guess it would be three or four. It's three or four. Okay. So you tune in, and then now you've got your spiffy remote, and it's way spiffier than using a. I mean, we could use like like that right there. Yeah, something like this right here, the ATI All in Wonder remote. And uh, you know, I have an All in Wonder machine. I've got an All in Wonder uh, video card as well. Yeah, I love I, it. I love getting in remote battles with you because that's the one flaw I found about these. And we're not going to get, well, I guess we could get in remote battles over this because you could get in too. Yeah. So I guess maybe the next step to this hack is doing some HT access stuff. But I think I want to talk about that next month with, uh, mm -hmm. with some security through obscurity. So tune in next month for okay. that. Okay, sweet. So I'm going to go ahead and shut this down. There's a little exit button. Or actually, uh, I want to talk about at the bottom of this. Oh, yeah. This is our actual playlist right here, shown so in like a hypertext. If thing. I wanted to go straight to the pure ownage in the playlist, I could hit that, and it would skip to any of the files in the playlist. It auto-generates that. Mm -hmm. So Based on the contents of our media folder. Yes. So great ways to just get your media with any of those applications, pipe it to your TV, mm -hmm. and now control it with this. Awesome, awesome, fantastic. So, as always, all the code will be in the show notes. And um, one little change to, to this segment, normally when we do PHP and Apache and all that fun stuff, we throw on an Easter egg with either our IP address or our DynDNS, and you guys had a lot of fun in episode one playing with our lights oh, turning nice. on and off. Yeah, so we're not doing that this time. Not that we don't trust you with our television, but... Um, um, we don't trust you. With our television. <laughs>